Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. So I thought I would do, um, you're going to hear me pop up here and there throughout this vlog. I officially failed vlogging this week. Um, it's just been hectic. Uh, I've been running all over the place, having a bit of an allergy attack, which I'll talk about later in the video. But I thought I'd introduce um, and explain what I was doing before you see the next couple of clips. So I decided, myself and Callum decided to walk to my parents' house, which is about eight miles from where I live. Um, and it was very, very hot last Saturday. I think it was 28 degrees, um, which was absolutely fine. We had, it took us about two and a half hours to walk there along the canal. I love the canal. I grew up along the canal with my grandparents on, they, had, they owned a canal boat, so we went on lots of adventures. Okay, so I managed to injure my foot, didn't I? Yeah. That sucked, that hurt. It's, now we've got to go to Tesco's and get more because my parents don't have enough and I have none at home. Great. Oh, you're really clumsy. And sorry Lee, I've stolen your flip flops because they're comfortable. We're back and I have some parcels. So I thought, ow, why not? So I think, first one is only little and I think this may be some tongue bars I'm really really hoping it is my tongue bars because we've had so many problems oh no don't worry about putting those in the fridge Callum so oh they're tiny so many problems they're really really tiny then I have been waiting for this path for over two weeks and I'm so excited. This is from Liv, who is my friend from Yorkshire. She ordered me some stuff from Bare Minerals. To be honest, I cannot remember what she, what I ordered and what, what extra thing she's put in here. And I know she'll love me opening this on camera. <laughs> Look, I love how she put my full name. <laughs> she's so sweet. I love Liv to bits. Now, the postman, being the postman, decided to leave it at our front door. Luckily, one of my friends picked it up because that would have been a nightmare. I wonder if this was the box it came in and then Liv just put my dress on it. So, I am so excited. Ooh, I see something. Oh my God! Olivia! That's naughty. She should not have done that. Uh -huh. Oh my god. That's a box inside a box inside a box. I know, but she, she really didn't need to do that. Liv, you're my favourite human being right now. Oh, thanks. I love you too, Callum. She's a favourite human being. Fine then. <laughs> Callum's jealous. So it's like a magnetic. I'm definitely keeping this. Oh, she's even wrapped it up. Liv, you're too cute. Why are you too cute? Ooh. Okay, so. Ooh. We've got Glam Go. These are really expensive. Nude Glow. Pearl Glow. These are all moisturizers. Ew. Right. So the first thing I ordered, oh no, it's leaked. Oh, poo. Oh, that's a shame. Oh well. Is the Oil Obsessed. And I was so excited to get this with, I got the Mix Exfoliator Smooth. So you put these together and it makes a really nice exfoliator and I love it. Callum, I'm gonna have to try this out on you it's amazing. Liv used it in the shop um, when I went to work with her one day. There was no one like in. So I just sat with her and she did it on me and I loved it. She also gave me the eye gel cream. Yes. Basically my eyes are obscene. You don't want bags under your eyes. So Liv has given bought well I bought these but I just got a discount eye gel cream I still need to give her the money actually 
I then also have the Bare Minerals 5-in-1 BB Advance Eyeshadow Cream. Ooh. That's so cool. 5-in-1. <laughs> so it's like this. And Liv has also given me the Smoothing Lightweight... Um, what does that say? Emulsion. 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 So I think it's like bring beautiful balance to skin powered by so it's a moisturizer from Bare Minerals. Oh my goodness. And then so Liv tried this one out in the shop and I fell in love and I actually have a mini somewhere. Um so I said to her, could you order me the full version? And it's this matte lipstick. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, and then she also gave me the same colour eyebrow pre um, lip pencil. I got a little um, brush, Glam Glow, it says. So I don't know if that goes with something. And then I also have what's this? Is that the eyeshadow? I'm really confused. Okay, I'm not really sure what this is. I might have to text Liv and ask her. Callum, I think this could be the eyeshadow. Looks. Was that highlighter? Looks like it because it says glow. Yeah. Either it's eyeshadow or it's highlighter. I'm going to have to message Liv and ask her what this little thing is. But oh my, she is adorable. Liv is so sweet for doing that. Thank you, Liv. And you guys are actually going to get to meet Liv very, very soon. She is coming down to see me. And I'm not going to put that back in because I need to give it a bit of a wash. Because it leaked. Um, coming down to see me very, very soon. And I'm actually going to vlog it. Um, so I am very excited. This box definitely gonna come in handy thank you Liv you really didn't have to so I'm gonna drop her message and I need to now put all my food away Sunday came around and I was not very well in at all it was nothing to do with doing the eight mile walk I had a severe allergy reaction um, next to where I live are doing renovation works and I think it's due to that um, so I was really suffering with my airways and just in general allergies. So I spent pretty much all day resting and sleeping and just feeling pretty groggy. Um, not 100% sure whether I, I was having a, getting a cold or not. And then Monday comes around, um, so you're about to see Monday, Monday's clips. So I've just got back from a very, very, very long day. It wasn't meant to be a long day, but it ended up being a long day. So um, I sucked at vlogging. I'm so sorry. So I ended up going to the doctors, getting <coughs> my hay fever tablets, and also getting my foot dressed because it keeps weeping and I really don't want it to get infected as well because it's hot anyway here. It's, I don't remember the last time I actually felt like this. Um, and I think also I'm not suffering from a cold. I think it's probably hay fever because I went to a different town today and I was absolutely fine. So I'm pretty sure it is hay fever playing up. Um, where I live is quite like in the countryside. Um, so I'm not that surprised really gutted um my like one piece uh what's it called not jumpsuit play suit i managed to shrink um so that's a real real bummer and has really annoyed me and upset me um because i loved it so i think what i'm gonna have to do is maybe order one off asos or from new look from the tool section this is the problem i feel like i'm finding the taller I get, the more trouble I have with clothes. Um, and it means that I can't always buy Primark. I can't buy certain things because they're just too short on me. Um, and also, because my weight keeps changing, as you guys, I didn't mention it in the last video, I have put on quite a bit of weight. 
and my goal is to lose a good couple of pounds um a good couple of stones sorry of this weight because this isn't helping um definitely with how i feel mentally and physically so the task now is to tidy that up that is just dry washing that needs to go away i'm gonna sort out all of this the tv's on i need to try and sort this out a little bit and do washing up Tuesday and Wednesday I stayed at my mum's, I went to see my sister um, and my niece and nephew and also went to stay at my mum's and see my little sister and my stepdad and it was great fun, so much fun, um, I love seeing her and spending quality time with them, um, so yeah if you didn't know I was adopted when I was three years old. Um, and in the last sort of couple of months I have reconnected with my birth family and it's one of the best things I've done I love going there I love spending quality time with them um, and yeah just in general it makes me really really happy it doesn't mean that I don't love my adopted parents any less I love them both as equally as I could um, yes okay my birth mum didn't bring me up but at the end of the day, she's like a friend to me. I see her as a friend. And my little sister adores me to death. And it's so much fun pl playing with a three-year-old. Not when you have a lot of things to do. Um, it can be quite challenging. But it is great fun to play with a three-year-old. So, brings us to today, which is Friday. Today, I had a very... Uh, some interesting appointments so I saw Craig who is my therapist if you've been following for a long period of time and I saw him and it was quite positive um, I, ex I told him about my concerns that I had and my fears and worries about the next couple of weeks um, as I am super super busy I then also went to a pain management appointment this was the first appointment I have had and probably the first of many appointments and they have enrolled me on a course um, and a program for 12 weeks. It's over a year so you see a psychologist and a physio but you also get to meet other people with um, chronic fatigue and also how to deal with pain. I have expressed that I would like to get back into my fitness and get off my painkillers um, and to be honest I came out of that appointment feeling really really positive. I came home and basically took a three hour nap. So yes, that is basically a sum up of my week. Um, the next clip you're gonna see is Tigger. Um, and I'm gonna put this in before, um, before the clips of Tigger, because I just want to introduce him. He is my mum and steps stepdad's uh, kitten he looks identical to Al uh, who is my mum and dad's cat also my cat as I claim um, which is so funny they are identical and so Tigger is 12 weeks old he is a bundle of joy and the reason his name is Tigger is because he bounces everywhere he is so energetic 